What's going on guys, CV Sneaks back with another video and today I'm going to show you guys how to make your own proxies. Um, I'm trying to make this video as quick as possible. So what you want to do is click on the link in the description. It will take you to this page right here. Once you have this open, uh, just follow the instructions. The instructions are very easy. If you don't even want to watch this video, just follow these instructions. If you need help, uh, just come back and hopefully I fixed whatever questions you had or whatever problem you were having. So what you want to do is sign up with this link. Uh, make sure you activate your account with ten dollars after you sign up because in order to create your own proxy you're going to have to sign up so after you do that you will also be granted twenty five dollars in free credits when you sign up with this code so what you want to do is go to your uh... after you create an account here go to my account billing it's going to pop up no information there you gotta input your credit card or whatever you want to do and just make sure you add ten dollars on there and just click continue after you do that you're set so what you want to do is go to servers go to server listing you're going to click deploy a server okay the server name doesn't matter uh... i'm just going to call it video for the description just put shoes after that click chicago now this will uh, make your speed fast depending on which one you pick these speeds aren't bad for stuff like adidas and stuff like that but these speeds are good for like shopify and stuff like the more up here now they don't charge you per month they actually charge you per hour this is just it's just ten dollars a month if you don't shut the server down which i'll show you how to do at the end of the video so what you want to do is click select on the sent os 6.9 then under SSH keys, you're going to show this. Scroll to the bottom. Go back to the guide. Scroll all the way down until you see uh, this right here. Then scroll all the way back up. Copy. Go back and paste it right here. That's all you need to do. And deploy it. It's going to take you back to your dashboard and it's going to show that the server is uploading now what the server is is the server is actually just the proxy okay so each server is one proxy keep that in mind so you're going to have a bunch of servers okay you're not going to have to do this every time okay so what you want to do is a day like you can do it right now if you want to, even though even if a release isn't until a week just because you're, you want to be prepared doesn't matter just make sure you do it at least the day before the release you want to set up all your servers, okay? So how, however many proxies you want to run, okay? After you do that, you can, you'll never have to do that again. So you won't have to, you can keep those same proxies. All you do is select the task and you can either shut it down, which will n make it so the server shut it down, the proxy doesn't work, and you're not getting charged per hour or you can start it which means that the proxy is going like it's doing right now it's starting it's going to be up and running pretty soon so that's pretty much it i'll explain that later in the video um, but until then i guess i'll see you guys when this is done okay so once your server is up it will look something like this it will be green indicating that the server is up and running uh, yellow means that it's doing whatever task you just told it to and red just means that it's shut down so what you want to do is you want to go to your notepad here let me just restart for you guys so you guys understand more go to your notepad copy the IP then paste it in the notepad okay after you do that go back to the guide and copy everywhere from here on out. The little uh, 3128 ghost kernel, and then ghost123. That is the uh, port, username, and password. Okay? It's in this format. All this is these three things right here. And, your, and the IP is right here. And you always just fill it in. Like we already did. so this is the IP right here so all you want to do is copy it it's green indicating that's good or whatever get a pro get a proxy tester
this one's free just uh, look it up all you do is clear the URL out get the link of uh, anything from Adidas if you want or anywhere depend on where you want to go I'm just going to do Adidas for this video import the proxy go to your notepad paste it submit it and test it and as you see the speed's good and it's working so that's how you make your own proxies uh, now in order to stop getting charged for every hour you just select it or you can do all your proxies if you want if you have a bunch and just force shutdown and run it it's going to go yellow and then it's going to go red indicating that it's not charging you anymore so you can leave this up okay whenever a release comes you can just hit all to all your little proxies and then just start them all up probably like an hour or two before the drop so they're all up and running and you'll always have them so you don't always have to keep making servers for each release you'll always have them just shut them down or else you will get charged for them so that's how to make your own proxies i hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching